Hello, I'm Sivam Krish. I'm going to show you today how to uh, geniform a twisted tower. Uh, first, we build a grasshopper definition of the tower, uh, which you can see here. Um, it's a fairly simple strategy. Um, but before that, let me show you the um, geniform components. We have only two, com two components for this one. One is the general geniform component and the other is the sliders. These sliders are exactly like the normal sliders, but you are made with uh, these components. We here have the um, X and Y um, dimensions of this. Basically, this controls the um, horizontal width of the, of the thing. You can see what happens when you adjust those. You can see that when you change these things, the horizontal radius has changed, and this is the vertical values of the tower. And these are we've kept both the maximum and minimum in the horizontal and vertical axis. This is the amount of. Um, splits in the z direction this is the amount of twist you can increase and decrease the twist and this is the width of the you can see that more clearly here this is the width of the of the component that is being wrapped around the task and uh, after that it's a simple operation we've uh, connected them up and then we have reflected them to create a double twist so all we need to do now is to start genoform and it picks up the design and just click generate so as you can see the designs are being Geniformed here, and we've geniformed five designs. Uh, we can increase or decrease the level of creativity. So you can see when you. Um, we can also make it a lot more wilder. So there you go, a fairly um, wild range of designs and all these designs are stored in here. You can then, if you wish, so store them in Excel and or XML. You can also filter these things, but we haven't gone to the filtering stage here. So it saves it in the same directory as your folder. So you can create hundreds or thousands of you can maybe we do 50 100 all right let's have a look The problem here, of course, you have too much design. So we have the filters to then uh, reduce the number of designs to uh, a reasonable number that you can go through and select. Okay, so we have now a total of 140 designs. Um, you can also navigate these designs by... 
Okay, we hope you'll be able to have a lot of fun with Geniform and um, take your designs and um, Geniform them. Thank you for watching.